Hey there friends, thanks for checking in. Most of the time when I carry, I have a belt on and my preferred placement is right here at four o'clock. I've been carrying that way for years. I know a lot of people carry appendix and they say that you can actually draw a gun quicker from that position than from behind the hip, but I'm not going to argue with that. I've seen many videos with people drawing appendix style and they have an extremely quick draw, but I like it back here. It's comfortable and I could draw pretty quickly with that position. But now we find ourselves in shorts or in gym shorts or in sweatpants or anything that has a drawstring and that changes everything. Many people pocket carry during this time and you know, I don't like that too much because gym shorts are typically very loose. It bounces around the pocket every time you walk, the gun goes back and forth. And I use my pockets for other things. I prefer not to do that. Even the smallest and lightest guns like an LCP, you know, that, that weighs under 14 ounces, even that bounces back and forth and it's irritating to me. I don't like it. So as I researched this, I saw that some people actually put a belt on underneath their untucked shirt and that makes no sense to me. I figure if you're going to wear a belt, why don't you just wear shorts that have belt loops so you can wear that belt and so I don't prefer that either. But the way I've been carrying with gym shorts or sweatpants or anything with a drawstring is right here, a cross draw. And I changed my gun. So right here, I've got a car PM9. I use the same holster that I would if I was carrying it at four o'clock. And it's that easy. You can literally just move it from one spot to the other. So you may ask, well, if you like the four o'clock position, why are you changing it to a cross draw? Back here, it tends to drag on the pants, right? Much like it bounces around in the pocket, it drags on the shorts. Over here, for some reason, it doesn't. It is so comfortable for me to carry right here. Now, this setup here, this is a multi-holster, car PM9, night sights, combined, I'm looking at 22 ounces. It's extremely light, and you may have to sacrifice a few rounds to suit your dress. You know, I mean, I could carry a, a FNS 9C like this. It wouldn't be as comfortable, but I could do it. It conceals well, it doesn't print. It's an easy way to CCW in the summer if you have gym shorts on. And I just wanted to share that because I, I practiced drawing, I practiced, uh, well, carrying. I've been doing it that way for years with sweatpants and or gym shorts or whatever. But most of the time I have a belt and it's a non-issue. But has the weather changed? I find myself in uh, I find myself in gym shorts more, and that is my preferred method. It's a quick and easy draw. I can even draw the gun right now, and the holster will remain in place. So that's my method. I wanted to share that with you guys. I also wanted to get some comments back to see what your preferred method is for carrying in gym shorts or sweatpants. And I have to believe a lot of people are going to say pocket carry, but I'm not sure. So I look forward to reading the comments and hearing what you guys say is the most comfortable way to carry a gun in gym shorts. As the weather breaks, we're gonna have to think about these ideas. If you like videos like this, please subscribe and share. I always appreciate the thumbs up button. Thanks for watching and you guys be safe.